everyone, and welcome to another edition of Sweet Talk. My name is Ian, and today I'm going to be taking you through our two-minute drill. My goal in this video today is to actually begin with an existing client, in this case I'll use myself, and we're actually going to create a project based on this client. I'm going to generate an estimate for that project, and then we'll go ahead and create a proposal to send out to that client as well. And I'm going to do all of this within two minutes. So let's everybody go ahead and pull out your stopwatches now, and let's begin that time. Now at this point we're going to start with the client and we're going to generate a project based on this client. At this point you can put in some of the details for the project itself. And you'll go ahead and select a project type. In my case I'm going to use the one that was specially designed for our session today. Now this project type is actually going to include a workflow that already links to most of the information that I need for this, including the templates that are going to be relevant in this process. So let's begin with plugging in some of the dimensions for that. And let's step through this process now. As I mentioned, most of the information that we're going to need is already going to be available within the estimate itself. And as we're putting in this information, it's actually going to populate things like our quantities for us in the estimate as we need them. So let's go ahead and close out this portion and move into the estimate itself. Now as the estimate is being generated, uh, most of the information for those dimensions that we've put in are actually going to be populating all these quantities as we're going through the estimate. It's going to calculate most of the information out. And you'll be able to check those numbers as they're coming in here. But for time's sake, I'm going to go straight up to generating the proposal under the Reports tab. Now in this process, you'll be able to go through and select any of the options you'd like to include for the proposal itself. including things like the dimensions to use as a talking point for our client, prorating the company overhead margin, and including whatever notes are going to be relevant for this process as well. From here, you'll actually be able to go through and review the details in the proposal itself. And when you're ready, you can come up to the Tools menu and email it out as an attachment. And at this point, let's go ahead and stop the clock. And it looks like we've got a little bit of time to spare. Now, most of the information, uh, like I said, that we set up for this process today is going to be available using the various different components in Construction Suite to speed up your process. Uh, from here, most of the information in the proposal template, for example, I've already gone through and customized so that I know that it's going to be using the format and using all of the information that I like to use in my presentation. And you can actually scroll through and see where most of these details are coming in. You'll also see in the estimate template that I've gone through and linked a lot of these portions to the dimensions in those relevant areas. Um, throughout the entire process here, you'll actually see the various different things coming in where they're relevant. And again, these are just designed to go through and help save you these extra steps of hitting every single one of these points to re-enter the same information over and over. Uh, once again, just speeding up that process, allowing you to churn out these estimates in a much faster fashion. And all of this comes together with just a little bit of an investment of time setting most of these documents up to speed up your process. Um, so once again, this is going to cover our two-minute drill. And stay tuned for additional Sweet Talk videos where we may explore some more of these features in greater depth or go over some of the other great benefits within Construction Suite and Construction Online that should help you save tons of time as you're going through winning more and more projects. So once again, this is Ian with UDA Technologies, and thank you for joining me today. Have a great one.